What's up guys, here is Ekta, welcome back for another summon session here. So I have enough to get another PT right here, as you can see, uh, right enough. Because uh, finally I decided to use my gems in order to get the 11 uh, tw or 12, I don't remember exactly, yeah, the 12 uh, miracle, uh, excellent wishes I needed. So here we are. Uh, and three supreme wishes, so maybe I'm gonna be lucky enough to cut the PT on this one. Uh, because let's be honest, on my last summon sessions, I wasn't able to cut the PT on the Supreme Wishes, so it could be interesting to do it in this summon session. But before we jump into this content, let me talk about the Master Campaign here, because apparently we are allowed to talk about the new change, which is coming this Thursday. Here on the effects, they are gonna uh, put the effect hit on the third position and the mastery on the fifth position. Uh, okay, we are gonna deal less damage using our uh, dot damage, uh, dot heroes, uh, but the effect hit on third positions is gonna open things to us. For example, here, uh, let's, let's have a look. Uh, let's use th three heroes from the faction. So I'm gonna use a Sigmund here to apply some HP burnings. And this is what I'm planning to use at with Ulcaster outside of the banner, Ulcaster with Ben uh, with uh, Ben Austin mm, will be a great combo because my Ben Ost uh, my Ulcaster will be able to uh, stun uh, to control enemies and to deal some direct damage because he will benefit from the crit damage bonus here. I'm gonna have the de more defense on my heroes and more effect here, so I can control them. I can deal damage and maybe if I try to use Nicolas, it's gonna work. And maybe if I don't want to use Nicolas, but if I want to use another direct damage hero this probably can work because I can I will be able to control them and deal high direct damage to them and some HP burnings and some controls etc this is gonna work this is gonna be great and it is gonna be the same comments for the next um, for the next stuff here for example, on the foresters here, uh, let's imagine I want to uh, use uh, Megan. Yeah, Megan is from the foresters with Ulcaster. He is outside of the foresters. So let's imagine I want to use other heroes from the foresters. Uh, who can I use? I don't have many great heroes, but still, I have some. Uh, maybe I can use a Mavka and maybe Melissa and maybe someone else in order to protect my heroes. But yeah, you know what? I'm got. I'm currently building her. Uh, so here I'm gonna have one support from the foresters to heavy DP, direct damage heroes and uh, him in order to control enemies. So now I can choose to replace someone in here. Uh, maybe I can use my Quinlan in order to try to, to control them. So I'm, I'm not gonna take a lot of damage or maybe my Catherine to protect my heroes and heal them. Or maybe my... Um, here, uh, my uh, Nicolas in order to protect me, or maybe I just have to not use my Ulcaster, but who knows, maybe use Nicolas and Catherine, something like this, or maybe Nicolas and Quinlan to protect them, I don't know, I have to uh, test the things, but it's gonna be more opened. Allez, on est parti, invocation, ça commence.
Un nouveau Ok, Igor. Igor, bah ça fait un nouveau DPS dans cette faction-là. J'avais envie de le tester à un moment pour voir ce qu'il faisait. So uh, I'm pretty happy about Igor because now I have another hero, another DPS for the faction, the Holy Light Parliament. I was lacking some DPS here, but I was expecting uh, to have another hero from this faction. I mean, I want Fiona and I would like to have Elena because in my opinion, Elena, uh, Elena is the best DPS at the moment on this faction, but maybe Igor can help me. Uh, maybe I'm gonna build him in the future because I think he has the highest DPS potential on this faction after Elena, but I'm still not sure about that though. Uh, I know that Elena is great as a bleeder. This is why I, want, I would like to try her, but Igor can deal some damage maybe, but I would have preferred to have Fiona here or Elena. But that's it, that's it. And about um, about her, uh, this is the exclusive one I can have on her, but I, I mean, I, uh, I already have a full team for the Dragon Tribe and I, I have another hero from the Dragon Tribe build. Six heroes at the moment, A5. So I want to build her soon, uh, but I think that she has some potential and maybe for the arena, if she has enough direct damage here, maybe she can help, but I want to build her soon. So, that was all for the video, I hope you enjoyed it, if it's the case, as usual, please like, comment and subscribe and then see you in the next one. Bye bye! Infinite Magic Raid. Play to slay.